All right, so the program went kaboom. Um, I went to a dimension portal and um, went to the dimensional door and it just went bananas on me. So trying to come back to the game and if I try to run it again and you see I have a copy which is uh, the, the previous game so I always do it like a backup until the end of the episode and then I will start a new copy just in case I messed up or something like this, so I can always return to before I started recording but uh, this one we can probably still save so we if we had tried to join in here in this world as soon as we log in it will crash the, the game again so how are we to fix this it's actually not so hard we're just gonna go to our finder and I'm using a Mac as you can see and by default it starts on all my files but <laughs> I just put it on my applications so we need to go over here and go to folder and the folder is gonna we're gonna go to library so a little um, this uh, it's on um, most of computers will be next to, in the one or next to the one I uh, on the Japanese computer is on the uh, on the two spaces of the zero but um so you find that one and then forward slash and library and then you click enter and then you will see all your um, uh, library uh, folders and on this ones we're gonna go for application support in application support we're gonna find the one that says technic and technic then we have mod packs and the mod packs uh, I have all the mod packs that I that I'm actually working in right now so now it's technic ticket main and inside here we have saves and in the saves there are the two um, copies that I do in the new world that I just use for practice and uh, it's just a creative stuff so this one is the one that I want to keep and this one is the one with the trouble so I'm gonna create a backup of that I just uh, command C and command V to copy and on this one I'm gonna call it um, dim door crash there we go and now I'm gonna just work on this one just for now if anything goes extremely wrong with that then I can always go back and get the backup that I did so oh, not that one oh, there we go so now I'm gonna refresh this and you see now we have three so I can work on this one or I can work on this one for this time I'm just gonna work on this one and go back to finder so if you go in here, I mean there's players and you can delete your delete your data, but um this actually doesn't work. This is my friend who used to play in this world with me, but um it's not no more. Um uh, dimensional doors, here we go. So you go to the dimensional doors and you can see all these pocket dimensions that this thing has created since the start of the thing. Uh, I'm not sure if I've been actually even seen all these doors, but um anyway, we can just move it to the trash. Or just click enter and rename it so just you know put a one there it's fine and what it's gonna do is just remove all the all the locations of the dimensional doors that existed now um, dimensional door world there's a configuration here and it says um, uh, enable risk gateways and clusters and you know oh not not much to, that we can change and the dimension that it had I think um, here you go the deaths, the dimensions, where they are, and everything. And it's just data that it says where the, the the dimensional doors are located out, and if it's a dungeon, if it's filled, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So um, I'm not sure which one was the one that I just entered. I mean, I be, I hope it was this, and I can just go and try to look for the X Y Z and try to redo it and stuff like that. But you know what? I'm just I don't want to lose all my stuff so I just put a one in there and then I'm gonna to go to the Minecraft and I'm just gonna start the game and you're gonna see what happens in here while it's the game starting which it seems like already started it created another door right here dimensional doors um, you press um, there you go so there is this one and it just created these other folders real quick and now we get to see where we are at so yeah we never enter the door we still have our, all our inventory and we are safe to continue 
our game. <laughs> that was scary. So one more thing. If you guys are going to be working with this stuff, you don't want to be going to go to go to folder and library and all this stuff again. So uh, what was it? Application support and then technic and then mod packs and then take it main and you know just go back and forward. So just grab the save folder right here and just put it in there. Boom. You click here and that will be there. So every time you just open your finder, you will have a link directly to your save. So that will save you a lot of time. And I hope that that definitely helped you guys. So um, I guess this will be like a mini episode just to uh, for the crashing report and stuff like that, how to fix the crashes. And then we're going to continue our real game, okay? All right, see you in the game.